Okay, I'm back. I made it. Everything's fine. <clears throat> I hope that the in-game volume's not too bad. Wow, we jumped pretty high. Look at this. Oh, this is gonna feel awesome. This is gonna be great. Oh, this is gonna be so awesome. I love it. All right, here we are in the big city. Hello there, Foo. How are you? Hi. Hi, how are you? How's it going? Savarius Atius. We will comply with the Watcher's orders. The Atius family will stay clear of the Sintavs if they stay clear of us. Sintavs? What? Imperial Sintavs? I agree with the Watch, Captain. This Atius Sintav feud has gone on long enough. I can control my people. I hope Ineo can control his. All right. Dreamers. There's been some terrible trouble at the chapel in Anvil. All of the Bella's priests and priestesses murdered. Ooh, that sounds terrible. They don't like that. Bye. Hello there, dear. How are you? Me children will thank you for your help. Ah, have a coin, beggar. Thank you, kind lady. You get the gift of charity, I believe. There's a new ship moored up in the waterfront district. The Marie Elena. It's a galleon, I think. <laughs> Let there us have our cay upon ye. Oh, aren't you so nice? All right. Whoa, we jumped so high. Go ahead, I'm listening. Are you, are you sure? Are you sure you're up listening? Soon. Do you know? Rochelle Bantian, Samuel's wife. I'm glad he's settled down to training and the quiet life. <laughs> Well, I'm glad. Also, what is going on? The shadows here. This is kind of strange. She doesn't really have anything to say at the moment. Bye! Something kind of weird with the shadows there. I'll have to figure that out later. Alright. Hey, here we are. Hello there, sir. I want to talk to you. What kind of deal can I make for you today? I need to sell a bunch of junk. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? Let's see here. Uh, we want to sell longsword. Actually, no. Hang on. Let's haggle it a little bit. Let's see if we can get him to go up a little bit. Yes. Oh, he went for it. Good. Okay. You drive a hard bargain. Oh, I'm glad I do. Short sword. We don't want that because damage. We want to keep the steel one. Steel one's really nice. Uh, let's see here. What else can we get rid of? We got a lot of junk. So much junk! Alright, we gotta get rid of all this stuff. An ex That's a good deal. Is it now? Are you sure? Yeah, these flawed gems don't really sell for very much. A good price? That. That's more than I'd usually pay. Is it now? Are you sure? Uh, we're gonna get rid of the soul gem. You've made a good bit of gold. Uh, let's see. We're gonna we'll keep those. Those could be really really good. We have a lot of rat meat. <laughs> uh, you know what? Let's sell a few of them because they do kind of weigh us down. Uh, actually, let's see. Let's sell about sell about half. There we go. That definitely dropped down a little bit there. Okay. Push of strength. Let's sell that. Uh, respite. We want to keep that magic. Just in case. We want to keep those. Uh, potion of night eye. We don't need that. We can cast it on ourselves. A good price for a good custom. Nice. Our mercantile went up good. A good price for a good customer. Oh, I'm glad you think so. Uh, let's get rid of that goblin staff. Actually, that's a pretty good deal considering it wasn't worth that much. Uh, let's see. And we only need one bow, so let's get rid of the, one of those. There we go. I think that will do it, I think. I think so. And, all right, I'm not going to buy anything from him because I don't want to buy anything from him. For Thank you for reasons. your business. He's kind of mad at us because we, uh, we haggled him. Goodbye. Please come again. Aw, oh, he's not that mad at us. He, he forgave us. He forgave us for a little bit of haggling. Okay. Uh, 
what's that? That is the bookstore. We don't come to see I'm an old war veteran. Uh. Well met. Have you seen the selection at Stonewall Shields? Okay, so what we have here? Merchants in fighting chance. I don't really want to buy anything because it was okay. So now that we got rid of a bunch of stuff in our inventory, how's our how are we looking? How's our inventory? Oh, that's a lot better. I can live with that. All right, now that we've done that, let's go back. We need to go back to the main. We're gonna go right back to the sewers for reasons. We have to go back here because we have some exploring to do. First off, I'm going to need to look around here. Excuse me. Ah, we want this. Good. There we go. Always take plants and herbs when you can. Anything else around here? Nope, I don't see anything. Ooh, our athletics went up. That's good. Anything around here we can grab? I don't see anything. Okay. Let's go. For our first little adventure. Oh, I think I see something in the water, though. I love how we can just jump in the water. From here. Aha! Right there. There we go. Aha! There we go. Is that all? Yes, that's it. Okay. Get back out of the water before we drown. There we go. Anything else? Oh, I think I see another one. Or is that the same one? Back up. Actually, that might be the same one. Okay, let's get out of here. So there are some bad guys around here. We have to be careful. And also, it's extra sneaky time. Extra sneaky. All right, let's see which one of these I can, you know, shoot a nice fat arrow in their ass. <laughs> Preferably in their head, but if I can get their ass, that's fine, right? counts. It's about sneak attack damage. If they don't see it coming, then it's supposed to do extra damage. Whether it be in their head or it be their ass. <laughs> and then they can, you know, I mean, uh oh. Do they see me? Where? You don't see me. No. Wait, is that something else that sees me? Seems a little strange in my opinion. See that one. Uh, actually, is there one closer? No, I think we're gonna use one. Uh oh, got pissed one off. Fall off, fall off. Oh, I missed him. Come on, man. Come on, right there. Oh, I missed him. Wow, he's really far away then. Let's try a little higher. Him. You see that? I shot him! I shot him in the face! Look at that! Wh where'd his buddy? There's supposed to be a buddy. Did I just kill him? And his buddy didn't even notice? Uh He's looking- <laughs> You're looking for me in the wrong spot, bud! I'm over here! Uh, wait, aren't there three of them? I thought there were three of them! Hang on, there's some arrows here those. I could have sworn there were three of them. Where's number three? I see that guy over there. Is he going to see me? Where'd he go? Is he dead? Whoa, this is weird. This has never happened before. There's like, I know there's more than one. I just saw one go over here. This is weird. This has never happened to me before. I've never had like them just wander off. Where'd he go? Oh man, don't you dare sneak attack me. I'll be mad. I will be mad if this punk sneak attacks me. Oh wait, wait, wait. I think I just saw him. Where'd he, where is he? Maybe. Did I? I might imagine things. Oh, 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 no, no, stay there, stay there. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, does he see me? Dude, stop. Moving. I get him. Oh, my God, I got him. Oh, I am so good. <laughs> I got him. But I could have sworn there were three of them. Where's number three? Are 
They're not three? Maybe I'm, maybe I'm imagining it. I don't know. Also, take the herbs. That's so weird. I could have sworn there were three of them out here. Hmm. I don't know. Seems fishy to me. As I'm going to the pier. <laughs> oh! Oh, maybe it was a mud crab that saw me. Speaking of mud crab, die. <laughs> Sorry, mud crab. You must die for the possibility that you will have something on you. Take that. Yes, he did have. How did he get a gold on? You know what? I'm not going to question it. Mud crabs are dangerous little fuckers. They'll get you. What's in here? Hello. Oh, a ring. Sure, why not? Principle of the matter. I found it. Finder keepers. Uh, nothing in there. Okay. All right. There were three people. Three bandits. Oh, well. Okay, let's go this way. I'm gonna stay sneaking just in case. Wait, there's a mud crab right here. Did he sneak off to kill the mud crab? And he didn't even have a freaking clue that I was here? Because if that's the case, I find that really funny. Uh, let's see. Ooh, he's got lots of nice clothes. How about you take my shitty cloth pants? <laughs> Actually, no, I don't. You know what? I'll keep them. I'll keep at least one for, I can sell that for later. But I will be using, I will be putting on those boots. Poor bastard. Sorry, dude. Oh, God, these are so damn heavy. I might have to come back for that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Plants, plants, plants. Don't forget plants. I'm an alchemist. I have alchemy. I must, I must loot the plants. Plants. I don't see, I don't see any other one. Okay, fine. You know what? I'm gonna stop sneaking. Uh, I don't need the leather shoes. Give me the arrows. That is so weird. Ah, here's the first guy I got. Where's the arrow? Right in his face? Uh, I can't really tell. Oh, well. Take those arrows. Oh, an iron bow. That's even better than what we have. Uh, potion. I'll take the purse. Uh, there we go. Okay. All right. Perfect. All right. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Anything else? No? Oh, hey, a book! Your hand, hand skill increased. Well, good, because I was actually planning on beating up people in the face. Haha. <laughs> Immortal Blood by Anonymous. Ooh. Cool. How many pages is this? Hmm. Oh, wow. I don't remember this one. I'll take it for now. Maybe I'll read it later. In my spare time. Sack. Okay, here we go. Got the sack. Uh, oh, yes, garlic. Excellent. Plant. What else do we got here? Nope, nothing here. Okay, good. Well, I was kind of... Oh, what's that? It's the mutton. I was kind of hoping that there was another person out here, but I guess not. All right, well, let's just go ahead and... I found the place that I've been at the last... I don't know how long... Apparently being right next to it wasn't enough. I had to be like in a special place right next to it. Okay, I'm getting all these food ingredients. Let's give me, give me, give me, give me all the food. They will create some good potions. Oh, uh, yes, please give me that money. Uh, let's see, anything else? Okay, while we're here, how many restored fatigue potions I create? Uh, let's see here, restore fatigue, restore fatigue. Uh, let's, that's ooh, it's a damage speed on that one, but I think we just want the restore. Wow, five, restore fee five points for twenty seconds on something. Nice, not bad, not bad. Okay, cool. Alrighty, uh, let's do that one, that one, and that one. All right, what else we got here? Um, hmm. Ooh, there's all kinds of goodies here. Uh, huh. Oh, damage fatigue, actually. That would be good because that could be... That's a poison. We can use that for later. Uh, restore intelligence. Restore endurance. I don't think there's anything else. Wait, hang on. No, I think I was writing that wrong. Okay, I don't think there's anything else we can really combine here. Okay, that's fine. Exit for now. Okay, perfect. All right. Whoa, wait, what? doing dead way the hell over here was there like a tidal wave that came from the water 
and smack this poor asshole right out of the water and he just hit this wall and now he's dead over here? Oh man, that, if that actually happened, that's a terrible way to go, I imagine, for any fish. Ah, oh, you poor bastard. Well, at least you got scales on you. I'll take it. Ah, oh, it sucks. You poor guy. Oh, well. You know what? I sort of feel sorry for you, but I also don't because... Look, look at these freaking teeth. These little assholes will get you. If, they're, if, you're, if you go into slaughter fish infested waters, they suck. <laughs> okay. We're inside the right dungeon. Yes. This is the first dungeon technically you do in this game. And you want to do this dungeon. Because if you do it right, ooh, you shoot that guy in the face. Oh, I poisoned him too, didn't I? Ah, uh, no, you don't. Oh, he's gonna hit me though. That's terrible. Oh, he actually still hits pretty hard. Oh, wow. Come on, dude. I need you to die. Wow, don't kill me with a freaking axe. Oh, God, he's actually gonna kill me. Oh, I need to be careful. I need to be a little more careful. Ooh. Okay, we'll take the gauntlets. I'm not taking anything else. First off, let's fix our uh, armor situation here. Uh, let's see, we need to put on some boots. And put on the gauntlets. Oh, wait, we had boots on. Oh, wait, which ones are better? Oh, the leather boots are better. Okay, well, let's put those on then. Uh, let's put on some better pants. There we go. Now we're not, uh, now we're not pantless. <laughs> We look a lot better now, don't we? We were running around pantless. It would have been weird. Really weird. Okay. All right. Cool. Also, we are really freaking hurt bad. Really hurt bad. All right. Let's utilize the power of healing. Uh, your healing powers combined. There we go. Okay. All right. So, I don't think there's anything down there. Oh, yeah. He dropped his mace. Okay. What's in here? Goodies? No, we don't need the torches. We're fine. Okay, so we gotta be careful because there are friends in here. And I want to be sneaky sneaky on the friends. Alright. Okay. I know there's one in this general area. The question is, where is she? face <laughs> or rather in the gut it works <laughs> we got her all right one less person to have to worry about heal that's a mana bat heal 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 now you have to be careful i believe because in this game they can hear you casting magic which is kind of rude if you ask me how much does that weigh? It doesn't weigh that much. It's kind of worse. Than this. Okay, what do we got? Uh, I don't think I want any of this stuff. Yeah, she doesn't really have anything of worth that I really care about. There's a trap right here, too. Look at that! A trap! It's a tarp, as we say jokingly. Down here. Very carefully. I hear the enemies. They're chit-chatting amongst themselves. Let's see here. Let's see. Oh, they're sleeping priest. They're somewhere over here. Somewhere around over here. Stay against the wall. Let's see here. Gotcha. <laughs> All right, there's one. I know there's another one, though. There's the other one. I see you. Oh, shit, there's another one. Let's get that one over there if we can. Wait, actually, let's get this one. Oh, God, I got him. There. And we were sneaking so well that this one didn't even notice us. shot <laughs> sucks to be you fuckers <laughs> all right let's don't get cocky though there might be another one we don't know about 
I can never remember. I can't ever count all of them. That might have been it, though. At least for this area. All right, what do you got on you, bud? Uh, ooh, ham. I'll take the ham. Oh, you have a helmet. I don't think I have a helmet. I'll take the helmet. Um, uh, must be as much as I'd love to take everything. It's not gonna happen because. Yeah. Oh, fur greaves. Actually, we need those instead of the pants because we need armor. So let's do that real quick. Helm, you look like an idiot. There we go. Some more armor. Armor is always good. There we go. Although we got to be careful because we don't want to make too much noise. This is all light armor though, so it, it's not going to make nearly as much noise as other stuff. So sorry guys, don't mean to leave you pantsless, but you know. Is there another guy? Just want to make sure I don't see anything. There's a guy over there up in the rafters, so. What's in the crate? What's in the crate? Uh, nothing. Okay. Eh. Uh, ooh, bread. Mmm, bread. Uh, what's this? Mead? Hey, I'm gonna get drunk. Can I get drunk later? It's a great idea. Mead sounds like a great drink to get drunk on. It'll taste good. It'll be excellent. What's this? Green robe. Iron grease. Clog. Okay, this poor guy. I just want to build away from far. Take the arrows. He has another bo iron bow. I think I'll take those. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start swapping out. I'm going to get rid of that crappy bow. Um, let's see. You can have that back. Let's see. Uh, actually, hang on. What was that? What? Let me look here. Offers three armor. Uh, okay, that does offer three armor as well, so, okay. Alright, just making sure I don't, like, miss anything here. Whoop, nope. We need to fix that. Oh, that's right! <laughs> you actually have to tell the game, hey, by the way, you might want to, you know, fix your weapon thing here. There we go. Got it. There we go. Perfect. I mean, I'm okay with, like, freaking beating up stuff. I probably should level my, uh, one hand, my, uh, beating up stuff. Alright. Oh, shoot. There we go. Yes, I know I've got pretty decent amounts of um, uh, lock picks, but I'm going to be very stingy with it as much as possible. Okay. Yeah, let's take all that. And I uh, don't think we're going to be much of a uh, pear smith person, but you know. Yeah, see, that, we, we kind of suck. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, nope, we're not taking those. So you want to go this way? Ooh, what is this? I have heard a rumor that a strange doorway has appeared on a small island in the Nebin Bay. I should investigate. Uh, <laughs> that is for a DLC. We will get to that for sure. But right now, we are focusing on doing this stuff. I don't think there's anybody in here. There we go. Uh, yes, take all the things. I don't think there's anybody in here. Oh, but we definitely want these. Look at all these beauties. They're worth 50 a piece. They are amazing. Take that. Take the money. I'm not picky. I'll take any money I can get my hands on. Food. Uh, guide to Imperial City. Dirty scroll. Some of the men were worried about these old runes being haunted, but Mafala, take them. This spot's going to be perfect for ambushing merchants along the road and all under the nose of the Imperial Legion. Finally got some of those big blue stones down today. Bernice got the idea to shoot them down with her bow. Got them all here with me. I don't know what they are, but they stink of magica. But they'll fetch a nice price with the Mage's Guild. Oh, I'll bet they'll fetch a nice price. There we go. Two coins in that Khajiit from Vardenfell set up their camps down in the tomb. Fine by me. Spares the rest of us the smell. Two coins ran up today. The Khajiit's gone missing. Swore to the nine that you could hear claws scrambling at limestone. But nothing's down there. I'm guessing she got tired. 
of the smell and snuck out overnight. Two coins stench could peel shells off mud crabs. I'm surprised she hung around that long. <laughs> ah, it's too funny also. What is this? Oh, hey, there's a dagger right there. Fortunately, I don't think you can actually loot the thing. All right, let's see if we can find some more food. Yes, I'll take those. Yes, please. Uh, yes, take all the food. Uh, battered crate. Oh, nothing there. Okay. Um, no. Okay, let's get on out of here. Uh, I checked the chest, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. Just checking all my P's and Q's. Okay, let's uh, drop that down so it real quick. Why am I still sneaking, you ask? Well, reasons. Ooh, another stone. Let's grab that. Yes, there we go. Here on the outside. you want to do is go over here, I think. Yeah, we want to go this way. We want to be very careful. Ooh! Our sneak went up, so there is somebody here. <laughs> yep, I see you. Hello. Question is, can I hit her from here? Got her. Oh, there's a guy right there in the face. Oh, right there. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's everybody. I think I got everybody. I think those are all of them. Take all of it. I'll take the other dagger. Uh, is that it? Nope. Take the lockpick. Oh, take the food. Take the food. Gotta take the food. We're gonna need all the potions we can get. Mm -mm -mm. Make potions out of food. Who'd have thought? <laughs> All right. Now I'm pretty sure down there is another guy. So we gotta be very careful. Now there's one more. One more? Just one more. Okay. She had a big hammer. It's a good thing we did not piss her off. Okay. Yeah, there's another guy right there. I think we can hit him from here. Hello, hey, come here. We're gonna have to go down this way. And we're gonna be very careful. Gonna hit her from here. <laughs> now that's everybody. There we go. Perfect. All right, so we got all the bandits, I believe. Okay, so the first part of this dungeon isn't too terrible. Because they're all a bunch of stinking bandits. Not too bad at all. It's when we get past this part that it's going to start getting a little rough. Okay. So I think we're good there. I'm going to now take our first nap. We're going to rest for one hour and there's no enemy, so we're good. But anyway. This meeting is a conspiracy to get me to your poop yourself. Supposed to be over and people keep asking questions. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Jack. That sucks. I can't believe we're still in that meeting. That really sucks. Huh? I'm happy because I got exactly the the class that. <laughs> well, then say something. Say something to them. See how they feel about it. Be like, look, I can't hold it anymore, bud. Yeah, this is ridiculous. I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm afraid Eric is not on your side here, Jack. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Mm. Um, I don't know that. Okay, we definitely need to put. Well, we got a very high agility. Let's do. Okay, let's do a strength. Let's do a personality. 
Oh, our luck is really high right now. You know what? Let's, uh, let's wait on the, I don't know. I should probably wait on the luck. Let's wait on the luck for next time. Let's see here. Uh, let's put into intelligence. There we go. There we go. That's better. <clears throat> All right. Perfect. And what I'm going to do is now we're going to do a nice hard save right here. There we go. Perfect. All right. We are level two. We have traversed the first part of the dungeon here. And I need to make some potions <laughs> before I forget again. All right. Let's see here. This is all restore fatigue, yes? I think this is all restore fatigue, so let's just uh, go with it. Go. Yeah, alchemy went up. Good. Uh, here we go. Gotta have our restore fatigues. Because you never know when you might need them. Alright, let's see here. What else can we do here? Hmm. What does this one do? Oh, nope. Remove that. There we go. Might be all we can do with that right now. Oh, there's another one. Resist disease. Cool. And it worked. Good. All right. Well, that wasn't too bad. Still some more uh, restore fatigues. There we go. Okay, let's exit for that for now. Okay. Whoops, nope, wrong button. All right, how's our, yeah, we're doing pretty good on, uh... we're still pretty heavy, but we can carry a tiny bit more. So yeah, he, he never is. I'm free, I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> oh, man. Ah, oh, Jag. I'm sorry that the meeting took too long. Mm -mm. Oh, excuse me. Mm. I apologize. I'm having a little bit of chocolate right now. Okay. All right. Oh, let's see here. Oh! Well, hello there, winter, winter water warmth, <laughs> daddy dragon, or, da or daddy dagon, oh, dagon, as in maroons dagon. <laughs> mm. Well, he certainly isn't my daddy, <laughs> and I wouldn't want him to be. <laughs> he is very intimidating <laughs> and very scary, as most, most danger princes usually are. The danger princes are very scary in their own very special, cosmic, powerful, crazy ass. <laughs> that includes the ones that are, you know, nicer because they even have their strange, twisted sense of morals. <laughs> uh, but my favorite will always be as far as the very special, crazy, and definitely more, more like, you know, on the... Uh, chaotic sometimes chaotic neutral but definitely a little more on the evil side we must we must uh, remember good old shagora and his love of cheese and his love to torment and confuse all the citizens of tamriel and strip away our sanity one <laughs> one bit by bit <laughs> but anyway sorry about that i got distracted <laughs> uh but welcome to the stream there winter are you a uh, are you a big fan of the Elder Scrolls? I gotta admit, I, this is probably one of the ones I haven't played very much of. Maybe one's Dagon, Data Ruler Destruction, in a bedroom. Ah, oh! <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't. I don't want to know his uh, his bedroom uh, habits. I'm uh, I'm okay with that. The Data Ruler Destruction, yeah. <laughs> He certainly has a very terrible place of oblivion. Although, although it'll be fair, though, his plane, his plane of oblivion is very um, um, terrible. Next to uh, um, Molag Ball's plane of uh, 
Oblivion. It's very, very terrible. Very terrible place. All right, let's get on in here. And get on with the really scary part of the dungeon. Because this shit's about to get a little more spoopy. All right, come here. Oh, come on now. There we go. Okay. All the things. Hello. Oh, that didn't kill him right away. That did. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Sorry, bud. No hard feelings. No hard feelings. <laughs> All right, take your arrow. What do you got on you? Uh, stuff. Stuff and more stuff. Okay. What's in the sack here? Oh, and a leak. I'll take that. I'll take a leak. <laughs> ah, it's a terrible joke. Something over here. I think he's the only one in here. Doing good, you. Oh, sorry, I'm not paying attention. I'm too busy, sneaky, sneaky. Sorry about that, Winter. Uh, but yeah, no, I'm doing good, doing good. Uh, yeah, I was telling everybody earlier that uh, this is probably out of all the Elder Scrolls games that I've played, this one's probably the um, one I've played the least amount. I've I've played a lot of it, but I would say that it's probably one of the ones I haven't like really traversed. In fact, I don't think. I don't think I finished or even started one of the DLCs that, um, uh, I think it was the Knights of the Nine DLC. I don't think I actually ever, uh, really got to touch that one. I did do, I did play on around on the Shivering Isles because it's the Shivering Isles. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think I, yeah. So this one's probably the one that I've done the least amount of stuff in. So I figure, you know what? I think it's time we uh, fix that, or I fix that for myself, and I'm going to remedy that by starting a whole new playthrough of it, and I'm going to try and knock out as much as I can. Oh, I know what this is. We hit the button. Your first was Morrowind. 2002 was a good year. Hell yeah! That was my first one, too. Absolutely. Oh, yes. In fact, I love Morrowind so much, I, uh, I actually started a, uh, a Let's Play of the uh, Game of the Year edition using my original Xbox copy that I bought for myself a long time ago. I started a Let's Play of it on uh, uh, my family's uh, YouTube channel. I'm kind of behind, unfortunately, on the episodes, um, and I haven't gotten that far into the game yet. But yes, uh, that one I'm very intimately familiar with, and uh, yeah. Oh, blood! I think we found out where that uh, poor Khajiit ended up. And there it is! You poor deer. You poor, poor deer. Alright, I'll take your arrows. I already have three bows. I probably shouldn't take another one. Eh, leave it. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, Morrowind was, was definitely my first, and it was the one that got me... I, I, I would say Morrowind and the Legend of Zelda games are the ones that got me hooked on the whole, like, the whole MMORPG genre in the first place. All right. Oh, come on. Really? Do, the, do me like that? Really? That's what I thought. You better let me in. Okay. I'm gonna go, I'll, we'll get that button in a minute, but I can't remember if I want to come down here or... No, I can't remember. Uh oh. I've been found out. Oh no. What am I gonna do? Oh god, it's gonna kill me. Nope. Did I hit him? I did. Dodgy, dodgy, dodgy. Oh, he got me. Crap. Oh, I missed. Okay, hang on. Got him. We got the bones. <laughs> I got the bones. I got him. Let's take the arrows. Okay, I know I pissed off some other critter in here. This is where it's gonna start getting a little hairy because skeleton skelly mans. That's okay. We need to practice our lock picking skills, right? Come on. Ah, damn it! Missed opportunity. 
crap. Oh, come on now. Really? There's that one. Really? Okay. There we go. Okay. Really now? Oh my goodness. Mm. I swear I'm better at this. There we go. Oh, for the love of... Come on. I mean, yes, I understand it's an average... Aha! I win! He's going to probably hit me if I'm not careful. Alright, you know what? Alright, let's see here. Normally I don't do this, but... Uh, you're undead, right? Light your happy ass on fire! Oh god, he's gonna kill me. Everything's fine. Whoa, hey! Don't just close the door on me. How rude. Let's make a bone meal, though. Where's that arrow go? Ugh, these damn gates. I know there's another one in here, too. Let's take those. And that. Uh, anybody else? Nope. Okay, we're good. Okay, this one's easy. Don't screw this up! Oh, come on. There we go. Okay, let's uh, light his ass on fire, too. Oh. Come on, light him on fire. Ha! Got him. I win. I got him. I know there's another one in here. I got, I got to do this. Because I'm not going to be a good thief. If I can't pick a damn lock worth a damn, I'll stop it. There we go. Aha! I win. Stupid rat. Go away. Uh, you know what? I don't need any more. What's in here? Take the money and run! You li I like how your full health and each hit from them only takes like a twelfth of your health bar, and yet you are overly worried about dying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'd be surprised. It'll sneak up on you before you realize. These guys definitely do hit pretty hard. Oh my gosh. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hmm. There we go. Aha! There we go. Got it. Open everything up in here. I did. Yes. I think I looted everything too. At least I hope I did. I don't have to come back down here. Okay. Oh, wait. Did I actually? I don't think I did this one, did I? I did not. Uh, that's. Okay, we can take it. You know what? No. That's not a good idea. Because I'm saving up for. Okay, let's get rid of this and get rid of that. And we're dropping the pants too. Okay. That's it. Potions, potions, more potions. Uh, let's see, damage fatigue, huh? Ooh, that could be good because that can be a poison. There we go. Uh, remove, uh, uh, restore fatigue, yes. Uh, what else we got here? Is that it for now? That might be it for now. That might be it for now. Okay. There we go. Cool. All right. All right. Let's go kill something else. We have a lot more to kill in this dungeon. All right. I came that way. So. Go in here. Let's go quickly. Drown. I don't want to drown. Woo! Okay. I see you. Oh! Ow! He hit me in the face! He hit me in the face! Come here. Oh, gosh. Let's punch him to death! Punch! Punch the bones! Punch him! Oh, That really starting to hurt. Come on, get him, get him, get him! 
Your turn. We'll beat you up. Ooh. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Ah. Punch it. Punch the bones. Beat him up. Beat him up. Come back. We can do this. Yeah. Aha. Gotcha. That's what you get for beating me up. I beat you up back. Aha. Okay. Is that everybody? Anybody else? Ha ha! So which game's locking me do I hate more, Oblivion or Skyrim? <laughs> oh boy! Oh my gosh! <laughs> that is, uh... I don't know. You know, I... Skyrim was a little bit more, I guess, sort of realistic, where it kind of makes sense that all you would see, if you were actually locked, if you were actually picking a lock like that, it would literally be a, it would kind of be like that, instead of this whole, like, you know, cut out of, you can see inside, you know. But, I don't know. I don't really, I didn't really care for either of them, but I think I prefer seeing the tumbler. Okay, do I want to go this way? Wait, hang on a second. Wasn't there another? Oh, there was. There was a way to get in here through here, I think. I remember that now. Yeah, okay. Well, whatever. Let's get out of here. Okay. Alright, let's go through here. Of course, you know, Morrowind is always the greatest because you just kind of, you know, point your pick and hope to got it. <laughs> hope it works. <laughs> uh, lock, pick, fail. Lock, pick, come on! <laughs> I can totally pick this lock. <laughs> oh, this one. Yeah. Can I piss off the skelly man? Or, I, or am I going to kill the skeleton before it gets to me? Maybe. Okay, I got his attention. Come here. All right, see if this works. <laughs> ah, I can't believe that worked. That's too good. Also, knock that down. I want these stones because they are worth money. Oh, I missed one. I missed it. I missed again. Oh, geez, I'm terrible. I don't play. You know, this is the right. This is the reason why I probably I don't really play first person shooters very much because I'm terrible at it. Whoops. He doesn't see me. Sneak attack damage. Got him. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm a dummy again. I can just take him. There we go. Take it, take it, take it. There we go. All right. <clears throat> I have a lock that cuts out like that. <laughs> You do? Oh man. Eric Ruff, what have you been doing? What have you been holding out on us for? For Oblivion's rather than Skyrim's at least there you could skip it. That's true. That is true. I hadn't thought about that because you can't skip. You can just auto attempt. If you think it's your skills high if your skills high enough, you can just auto attempt and actually, you know, do it. That that is true. I completely forgot about that. Skyrims, you have to sit there and stare at the damn lock and hope to God you just kind of like, oh, come on, freaking A. Morrowind's a superior. <laughs> Morrowind's was superior. I don't know. But, uh, okay, I'll be honest. I don't know if it was necessarily superior. Yes, I liked it, but it was purely, it was, you know, you just take your lock pick and point at the lock and hope that it works. Same thing with Disarming Trap. Is this going to work? Do I touch it? Is it going to work? <laughs> but at the same time, it was, it was pretty good. Uh, I know there's something in here. And it's probably going to sneak up on me and scare me shitless. It's going to scare the crap out of me. I know it is. Or maybe not. Maybe there's nothing in this room. Maybe it's not this room I'm thinking of. Maybe it's a different room. Oh, come on. Oh, for the love of... There we go. Okay, well, at least they're giving me some lockpicks back. 
Well, that didn't piss off anything when I just jumped by accident, so whatever. Okay. Alright, let's grab these. Come here. Come here. Nope. These I jump really good. I'm really excited, though, because um, when I got done with the... Um, when I got done with the uh, tutorial for this uh, the game, because the tutorial of this game essentially at the end of the tutorial, we all, you know those who play this game, you talk to, you get to talk to one of the uh, the uh, guards that was leading the emperor out, and uh, after you get done with the whole thing of you know he says hey take this key and you're gonna go through the sewers and you're like oh the sewers, he's like yeah there's rats and goblins in there but from what I've seen of you you're an experienced and he will give you a class based on how you essentially performed. Um, or how the game perceives how you performed through that whole freaking little crawl you had to do down there in the Imperial walkways and shit. Um, I actually got him to say the one that I was hoping he would say that I wanted really bad. That has never happened in this game. It's never happened. Every time there's one I wanted, no matter what I did, it never freaking happened. And it actually finally happened. It's like, yes! I bet there's something in here, though. I heard, I heard that. Ooh, it's poopy. The door closed from behind. <gasps> We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're doomed. Now we're fine. Everything's fine. Um. Ah, shit. I'm not gonna remember. It's this one. Nope. I guessed wrong. Shit. Kill it. I can't kill shit. Come on. Got it. They ran into it. Fine. Is he the only one? Wait, there's another one in there. Where is it? Wait. Where is it? Oh, it's the ones behind the doors. I pissed it off. Now let's go ahead and open this up. Skelly man, give me that bone meal. Thank you kindly. You have a nice day. Sir, or ma'am, you would say superior lockpicks had different qualities which affected your chances. That's true. Plus, probes in this magically trap. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I remember a few times where I didn't understand what trap freaking meant. Oh, and I would screw myself so bad. <laughs> it said trap, and I went, "What the hell does that mean?" I can't believe I went. I think I think one of my first playthroughs of Morrowind, I did not understand what trap was. I didn't understand what probes were for. Didn't have a clue wasn't until probably a second playthrough that I finally went, I'm an idiot! It dawned on me. I was like, that's what they're for! And on top of that, I went, oh, and, you, and if you come up to a trap locked item, you must probe it first. Then you lock the kids. Oh, so, oh, man. I think my brother was there for that one, too, and he's like, really? Ah, oh, shit. I'm here. Come on. Oh. Ha! Can't, can't hit a jumping target. <laughs> moving target, moving target. I don't remember which one it is, so we'll just open them all. I think it was this one. Nope, oh, uh, this one was uh, just the chest. That's fine. Oh, that is the right one. That's what I needed. I needed the chamber key. Unfortunately, I think because we pissed off mobs in here, we're probably going to have to just open them all up. So, let's do it then. Because I'm crazy. Oh, shit. Whoop. Whoa, that was weird. Did it just bounce off of him? That was weird. Okay, that was definitely a chance I took, wasn't it? I know you're here. Back up. I gotta admit, though, I'm having a lot better time doing this. Because if this were on the controller, oh boy, let me tell you, I wouldn't be able to hit shit. I mean, I'm not doing, I'm not doing great. Okay, let me put it this way: if I miss once on a mob, I'm okay with that. If I were doing this on the Xbox, oh hell no, I'd be missing like all the time. I'd be missing every single shot because, yeah, skinny man. I actually. I was arrow back. 
which is why when I have played on the original Xbox version, I never bothered leveling Marksman, ever, because it was a nightmare for me to try and aim at that shit. Hmm. This is a no asked question at all. Where would you like to see the Elder Scrolls Six set in? Oh, man. Oh, shit. That's a good question. Well, the, um... Well, the Khajiit lover that I am, <laughs> I would love to go to elsewhere. But I don't know if they're going to do that um, since the Elder Scrolls Online had a whole expansion dedicated to elsewhere. Um, which isn't entirely fair because, honestly, I mean, they also did one for Somerset. And they could also do a uh, Somerset-themed one if they really wanted to. Somerset would almost be could almost be appropriate because of the fact of we were dealing with the Almiri Dominion in uh, Skyrim. So that would be an interesting segue into, all right, you damn high elves. You know, you've had, you've had your, uh, you've had your fun with uh, torturing all of us that you think are so much lesser than you. And we're going to come banging on your uh, doorstep and tell you no. <laughs> but uh, yeah, but of course, you know, that's just me. <laughs> I would love elsewhere. I'd love to go to, uh, you know, the land of the Khajiit, but that's, that's just how I am. <clears throat> uh, Black Marsh, Komodo fan that I am. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, Black Marsh would be fun too. Yeah, the Argonian, the Argonian homeland would be really, really fun too. Yeah, I'd be, you know what? I would be okay with that too. I would be very okay with that. And I do like, and I, you know what? And honestly, I do like the Argonians. I mean, yes, I don't ever roll Argonians as a character, but I like Argonians. All right. I know you little fucks are in here. Aha! Gotcha. All right. Let's see here. Take that. So I need to, okay, I, can't, I need to go up. Because that, I need a le there's a special lever, so let's go do that. Ooh, I'm kind of hurting. Let's fix that. I know I have uh, health potions, but might as well level restoration, even though I don't have it as one of my major skills. It can't hurt. So, next Elder Scrolls should be set in Northrend. Wrong game, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> Technically, Elder Scrolls already had their Northrend esque, and that was Skyrim. <laughs> if we're talking about weather, if we're going by weather alone. There we go. All right. Get the shiny stone! Oop, got it. Mine. And now we're going to hold on to that rock for a very long time. <laughs> I'm not going to sell that yet. I'm popping pinning that I, that I actually get the Thalmor. You understand them. I don't know. Oh, crap! Oh, he hit me. Oh, crap. Oh, oh, crap. He got me. Well, at least our light armor went up, which is fine. Uh, what has he got on him? He had some more arrows, and I'll take that bone meal, please. Thank you, guys. I'm glad those stones didn't weigh very much. Okay, so we gotta go up. Up, 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 up. All right, here's the. This is the last part of it. I don't know. I had a hard. I had a hard time getting behind the whole uh, the Thalmor. You know, yes, the the alt the Altmer are very, um, uh, very smart, very wise, and obviously they've lived a very long time, kind of people. But um, they uh, they just they kind of rubbed me the wrong way. I think if they did do a, uh, if they did do one, if they decided to go to like Somerset or take us to Somerset or whatever and maybe give us a better perspective of, uh, the, uh, High Elf, um, the Alt, the Altmir, uh, area and their way of thinking, that would be fine. I could probably get behind that. <clears throat> All right, let's see here. Oh, shit. Eventually, we'll be able to just one-shot these damn skillies. Got him. 
eventually, but not right now. All right, let's see here. Take the bone meal. All right. Now there's another one in here somewhere. Oh shit, not this. Crap. Alien statue. Yoink. Take that. Uh, I think I want to go forward. Yeah, I think I want to go forward. Woo! Alright. Let's go up. Sneak. High elves live for a thousand years. Will thou more now? Were children when Talos led the Empire to invade and conquer Somerset? Enforce the human gods on them so Thalmor really just returned in favor. Oh, yeah, ha <laughs> ha! Oh, yeah, Ty Tiber. Talos, aka Tiber Septum. Oh, I hadn't thought about it that way. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Wait. Yeah, no. Was, was Talos back there? Was that a thousand years? Or maybe it was. Oh, my God. I'm all screwed up on my timeline. That is a good point. Is that really what happened? I can't remember. Oh gosh, now I'm all screwed up on my timeline now. Oh boy. I guess I better go back up and brush up on some of my lore because I don't remember. But if that's actually what happened, that's a good way to look at it. That's a really good way to look at it. That would, that would really suck. Ooh! We leveled while we're in here. Oh, hello. Actually, yeah, we're gonna do that. In the bait. Really? Really? Did I just seriously do that? Okay, first off, let's poison the bow. Got it! Oh, he's dead anyway. <laughs> oh, whoops. Uh, let's see, I didn't know if you. Uh, dark shirt, copper ring. He's got leather bracers. Take his robes. That arrow, exit. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oops. Is that it? Did we get him? Did we get him? Did we get everything in here? Look at all these dead bodies everywhere. Necromancer's sack. We'll take that mort flesh. I'm not taking anything else. Uh, ooh, I'll take the lotus. Lotus seeds. Another mort. Ooh, lockpicks galore. Mm mm. Yes, please. Oh, yes. Give me all the goodies. Uh, some books. Well, I need the books. What is this? Undelivered letter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is funny. A Luke, my friend, I apologize that I have not written before now and pray that you worry not. How could you have known that your patrol would stumble across my outing at the cemetery? There was no denying my deed. A sack full of limbs and grave soil still fresh on my boots. With your men standing by, what choice was there but pursuit? Lest they suspect your own true nature? Truly, I am glad it was you to expose me, and not another whose spell fire may not have missed my escape so widely. My new haven provides safety and bodies to work on, whether those long dead or hapless, or hapless bandits. I will be content here for some time, Though I dare not yet to say where, care for care for Kesu, and know that when the time comes, I shall return to live again in our beloved Dagger Hall. Until then, Captain Cardius, remain vigilant and always hidden. Uh, Dalbert, Dalbert, whatever. <laughs> oh boy, we killed a necromancer. It's so not cool. All right, let's see. Bone meal. All right, I think that's uh, that's good here. Now let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> it's, it's, it's the direct reason why they despise Talos, the man who led the invasion of your country without without cause, becomes a god, and you're forced to acknowledge him. <laughs> it's been less than a thousand years, but that is their max age without magic being used. Ah, okay. I knew they could live for a very long time. But I didn't know they could live that long. 
That's pretty awesome. Yeah, we can get out of here. Let me out, let me out, let me out. This place is terrible, let me out. I don't want to be, I don't want to be in the area of a, uh, of a, um, a, a necromancer anymore. Terrible things. All right. Ooh, hey, a box. What's in the box? Another potion of healing. Yeah, we probably should start using more potions because, and we can jump down here. Boop. There we go. And we're back at the beginning. Look at that. It's like it planned it that way all along. I don't know if this went up. That's good. All right, I'm going to go outside. And there's a bedroll near a campfire. Excuse me, dead guy. I'm going to use the bedroll out here to take a nap. There we go. Uh, wait, where's the bedroll? It's over here. Okay. Okay. I know none of these guys will mind if I just uh, use their thing here. All right, let's rest for one hour. Most elves are naturally sterile or only capable of having max two kids. Nature's equalizer. <laughs> wow. Damn. Really? Wow, I really need to brush up on my lore. That's crazy. Okay, let's see here. We want, what do I want to do? Okay, I did that one. Okay, I did that one last time. Uh, let's see. I don't, uh, I don't, I don't know. Could do that one, but actually we need to make sure we're... Okay, strength is definitely important for right now. Uh, we're going to bring up our intelligence again. And let's do... Always a little bit of luck. A little bit of luck never hurt anybody. <laughs> I always put a little bit of luck if I can. I didn't do it last time. Normally I do it every single time. But since our luck is pretty high, I decided to wait on that. All right, so we got out of our first little dungeon. And we made off with a pretty good haul there. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and use our handy dandy little cheaty map here. <laughs> We're going to go right to the Imperial Market District again. It addresses it in Morrowind. Oh, uh, I must have missed that somewhere. See, it shows you how much I really pay attention to either reading or when people are talking. Uh, yeah, the little bit that I know is, uh, I know that the, uh, Dunmer were not always called the Dunmer. I know that. And, uh, lore-wise of what happened to them. Don't quite remember how long they can technically live for. Are they? Well, actually, they might be about the same. Uh, so it's nighttime. And unfortunately, because it's nighttime, we're not gonna be able to sell anything anyway. But that's okay. Okay, let me think here. So my next course of action, I could wait it out. I could do daytime. Probably a good idea. Yeah, let's see here. <clears throat> uh, let's wait. Okay, how long would I like to wait? Let's see. Oh, it's ten. Yeah, it's, it's ten o'clock at night. So yeah, we're definitely not going to be able to buy anything. So let's do. Uh, let's see. Twelve hour. Okay, I'm not very good at math. Let's do. Let's do nine hours and see what we get. It is in the game. Oh, okay, it's in the books. Okay, yeah. That's see. That's my problem is that I have not. I did not take, and even to this day, I still have not gone back and actually read through all the books. Oh, jeez. I don't think that the uh, the guard's gonna give you any money there, dear. I've already given you money, dear. Sorry. I'm gonna come over here. Actually, what time is it now? Uh, it's after seven. Oh, I don't think the shop's open until eight. Shoot. Ah, well, that's okay. All right. Well, that's all right. I need to. Oh dear. I need to probably take my second break before uh, my back starts getting angry at me. <laughs> I'm fine right now, but knowing my luck, in the next 10 to 15 minutes, all of a sudden, my uh, back will be very upset with me. So, all right, I am going to take my second break now. And it might take me a little bit while to switch screens, because I'm still trying to... This is the first time I've actually... Well, not, it's not. this isn't the first time I've played a game on Steam for the stream and everything, but still trying to get used to the whole, like, how you have to do the shift tab nonsense and everything to get out of it. it drives me crazy. So, 
Before I do that, though, I'm going to do a nice, fat, hard save right here. There we go. Save successful. And we're going to sit right there. And, uh, okay, now I will get on out of here, and now I will go take a quick break. And I will be back in about uh, five-ish minutes or so, give or take. 